Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of StarCraft. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that you chose to join me today as we continue making, uh, well, Good day, battle cruisers. We continue Make to make battle cruisers, so we're gonna be ready here. No, let's not do that. Let's be over here. We're gonna be ready with a victory fleet pretty soon. We're gonna need some more SCV, uh, more um, supply depots. Yes, let's get you to build one then. Let's do this over here. We're building an academy over there. Uh, okay, I think we're good. Uh, let's All see. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna send... Uh, let's get these guys up here. Might be a good idea. Let's get you over there. We got two battle cruisers coming in. Yeah, I'm gonna use this as a victory fleet, basically. Uh, where, where are you? Okay. We got this guy over here. Oh, oh, oh. Where, where, where? Oh. Ah, that's gonna go well. Okay, so they are here. Which is less than ideal. Let's bring them back. Uh, job finished? Yeah, good for you. Uh, let's get this over here, right and then do that. Uh, I'm gonna need the plating, uh, and I think that's gonna be fine. We're gonna have these two guys, these two barracks, doing their thing. Actually, I could start doing that pretty soon if I just get a few more supply depots. Of course, the depots are gonna be for, for the, the battle cruisers. Uh, but yeah, the idea is to bring the battle cruisers this way. And just start attacking these guys. The problem we're gonna have, of course, with the battle cruisers, is gonna be the ghosts. Uh, and the problem with the ghosts is that they have a, a lock mechanic, uh, which you might know, and it's pretty nasty and bad. Uh, so let's see. I'm gonna save some of that. Okay. So from here, I think we'll be fine. I'm gonna send you up there as a backup. Uh, we got a job finish over here, so I'm gonna get some of that. And uh, what we're trying to do right now, by the way, the reason why we're attacking that is because we need the minerals as soon as possible. Uh, so these guys are going to come with us. Let's get them down here. And the battle cruisers are going to come with us. So let's do this. Hey, move. Over there. Good. Okay, so, so we, we're regaining some marines back here. That's good. Let's get you up here. No, it's too dangerous for you. Okay, we've got another battle, uh, another... On one of these, and that's pretty good. Oh, 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 why? Oh, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Oh, the thief tanks. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, this is gonna be bad. We don't have all the battle cruisers ready. We don't have all the battle cruisers ready. Where, where's the SEV? SEV? Okay, where's the other battle cruiser? Did, oh, someone gets got. There's another. Kill it, kill it! Kill that! Kill! There is another battle cruiser, right? Uh, I lost the battle cruiser. I th I thought I had another one. Yeah, these guys are pretty dead. Let's make more. Okay, I don't have too many battle cruisers, but um, it's fine. Survived. We survived. Why are th why do we have so so few? Not enough minerals. Frequencies mm. open. Okay, so they're going over there. The idea is to attack from this side, and I think we'll be okay because we can use uh, these guys against. Uh, uh, that was another battle cruiser, right? Am I going crazy? Well, I am. You guys know that, but uh, okay. So these guys are good to go. Yeah, these are basically going to be uh, reinforcements and all that sort of stuff. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There is a nuclear launch up here. I think he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. Okay. Up and good to go. Upgrade complete. That's good. Uh, where's the upgrade? It's this one. Got some day, of that. Commander. Okay. Then you are gonna attack over there. And we have this to come here and take out those things. Get those guys out. Yeah. Get that guy out. Okay. I think this might work out. Good, good, good. Okay. Take that. Take yeah, this is good. Take that. And then we can as soon as that guy's out. Yeah, we can. Whoa, he got a shot from over there. Okay, so yeah, this is the point. Uh okay, then we're gonna need more. We got another one over here. Bring you over there. Get you guys over here. Keep you guys going. Hopefully not getting attacked on the right one. 
uh, and getting these guys up, getting these supply depots here is gonna be kind of important. Kind of important, not too much. It's gonna be okay, but uh, I'm a little bit nervous about this because we have very few of these guys, and uh, it's important to have a lot. <laughs> okay, so uh, uh, now we have. Okay, yeah, they're building. They're building. We did a very serious hit. We dealt a very serious hit before. Uh, to these guys, if I can take that out, that'd be great. They repair just enough, so that thing doesn't destroy itself or something. Okay, and they're making, you see that over there? Okay, get you guys over here. Uh, no, not you. Get you guys over there. And you as well, up there. Kill that one! Kill it! Kill it! Kill it with fire! Okay, I think we'll be fine. Okay, there's Marines coming from there. Okay, so that thing is out of commission. And, uh, we're good! We're good! We did it! We destroyed them! Woo! Okay. Uh, make more. Uh... Oh, that's not great. No, it is. Uh, we're gonna need an SCV up there, if we can. As soon as possible. Get them up there. I'm not sure if this is gonna go well, but it might. Yeah. Okay, battle cruiser operational. Need another one. Almost Vaseline gas. There we go. Do we have Vaseline gas up here? I hope we do. Uh, so we're gonna make a build. Yeah, well, do we? We don't, do we? Well, we're doing well, I think. Okay. So, yeah, we're gonna need to send the Marines a bit alone. Okay, you're gonna stay over here and defend. You're gonna make one of these things, and uh, that's that. And we have to. We have, yeah, we do. Okay. They have. We'll find upgrade complete. Let's get one of these sufficient Vespin gas. gas. Okay, let's get you up there because I think this is now the Beating only defense that we need. Okay. Uh, the problem here, of course, is going to be defending this base. So let's just leave them there. We're going to need to repair. Uh, so whole position there might be good. So let's get you up here as well. There's somebody coming this way. So let's get everybody over there. Uh, yeah. Ooh, that's interesting. I think we have dealt enough of a blow that they will Battle not come back from where they are. Healing frequencies open. Okay, we, we, that was good. Yeah, let's bring them over here. Make it happen. Uh, we're gonna need to bring you up there as well to make another one of these things. Uh, let's see, are we making anything else? No, we're not. Let's get uh, you under development on that one. And then another battle cruiser over here, so we are gonna get, yeah, okay. So I think we have enough battle cruisers to continue our devastation over here of their nastiness. As soon as we destroy that, and then we do this. Oh, 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 that's that's bad, that's bad, get back, get back, get back, get back. Shut up. Okay, we attack over there. And there's this guy over here that attacks over there. So job finished for you, that's great. Repair every single one of these. The good thing about the battle cruisers and the bad thing about the battle cruisers is that they kind of tend to uh, stri uh, they stray away from each other. Which is kind of bad if you want to keep them all in the same spot. Uh, but it's good otherwise if you want to repair them. So, yeah, I think we're doing well here. Uh, okay, so on this side, we'll be ready with these guys. Uh, we will... Okay, job finished over here, so we're making that. And uh, we have another one of these things, so I can set it to nine. Uh, I'm gonna send... I'm gonna need to make more. Yeah, basically I'm gonna need to make more SCVs. Okay, you guys go over here, because you're going to do many, many bad things to those guys. I don't think they have... Uh, yeah, let's bring you over there, and you as well. <laughs> There's one guy somewhere that's completely dead, and he's just... He knows what he's doing. Okay, let's get a scans. Yeah, we got... Nice, okay, SCVs. Make them. And uh, let's bring you over there, and then A move after that. And you bring over there, and you A move after that, okay. So these guys are all the battle cruisers I am gonna need, but I'm still gonna make more. Uh, we got, yep, yeah, we're gonna make that. Is that a? Receiving transmission. You guys need to get out of there. Oh, I was not seeing where it was. Okay. Are we good? I think we're good. Okay. There's things that are being destroyed up here. Oh come on! It's these guys. Are they without a base? Hey, move over here. We need to destroy that up there. Okay. Good, good, good. Yeah, we need to destroy that ion cannon. It's gonna be easy. Or it should be easy. So you have a few of those things. Oh, you can get past? Oh, so that's why. 
Okay, let's get you guys down here then. If you can go. Oh, there's a passage. Okay. They're gonna all die, basically. Oh, you can go through the back. Okay, that's not as good. Let's, move. let's do that. Okay. Healing um, is open. Do we have an SCV over here? Reporting. Yeah, he's repairing. Receiving I think we'll be fine. Uh, well, actually, you know, you know what? Screw you. Little guy, start doing that. Let's go. We're repaired enough. This guy's not, but... He's at the forehead. Of course he's at the forehead. Set the course. Yeah, the Ayamato cannon over here would be so good. Uh, what is that we need? The science machine? Is that it? Is this it? Yeah. Right there. Yamato gun or whatever. Okay, so we destroyed all of them. And there's even another base over here if Battle we needed it. Nice. Okay. Send Make them all in there. And uh, that should be enough. Insufficient vest beam gas. gas. Of course. It's all... Oh, wait a minute. In the ex in the expansion in the expan okay I need I need to scan here in the expansion okay we're all toast I think in the expansion the battle cruisers take more supply supply them than they do now okay. Get scan here, make sure they're all good. Let's micro a little bit, get you out of there, because you're being attacked by that battle cruiser. He's gonna move. He's not gonna move, let's attack him. Uh, I think you are gonna need to move as well. Of course, he's attacking him. He's not idiot, an idiot, he's an evil, evil person. Okay, it's going well. This is going well, we're getting our battle cruisers back. At least that thing doesn't do uh, AOE damage. Okay, somebody's attacking me. Oh, he's dead now. Okay, research complete. I think we dealt a good blow to those guys. I'm gonna make a few SCVs over here. I think three should be enough, so just for repairs. But the research over here, we have the Amato Cannon now. Uh, let's do that. We're gonna also uh, make that, because, sure, why not? Uh, let's get this plus this. No. Shift, click, control one, and uh, let's get you repairing things. Right away, sir. Orders received. There we go. Yeah, you repair that. You repair that. Okay. I think that should be enough, actually. We have basically destroyed everything. Yeah, let's push on. I, I think coming back was important, but let's get you guys. Eh, we could make we could make a repair a repair place over here. Eh, sure. Let's do this. Let's go in and make with the battle cruisers. Who dies, dies. Who lives, lives. Who wins, wins. How's it going? Who dares, wins. That's the one. Well, we dare. We dare. Even though that's kind of not going to... Maybe not going to go as well as I wanted to go. But we have the Yamato guns. Is it course. called? Yamato guns. Yeah, see, Yamato cannon. Engage. Why? Why? Why do I do that? Why do I say Take that? It slow. Okay, so let's bring you over there. Press Y. Engage. And that. Uh, they just destroyed my Yamato cannon. Okay, you're gonna get out of there. Not yours. In the cage. Okay. Yeah, Receiving what you just saw there was... All okay, you're almost done. Set the course. Just get, get it ready. Over Take there. It, slow. it has a range of amazingness. So yeah, that, that was the science vessel. Screwing up my life, basically. Let's keep an eye out. Keep an eye out for ghosts. Make it happen. That will be around here. Okay, let's get it over here. Yep, there it is. You saw the, the little spot. Yeah, let's see if I can get my cannon this guy. No. Okay, we got the research. That's these guys over here. Is it? Maybe. Do I need to? Oh, victory! Yeah, we did it! We destroyed the iron cannon so we can leave the sector. I think it is the sector, not just the, the planet. But he's now the Emperor of the Terran Dominion. Fellow Terrans, I come to you in the wake of recent events to issue a call to reason. Let no human deny the perils of our time. While we battle one another, divided by the petty strife of our common history, the tide of a greater conflict is turning against us. 
threatening to destroy all that we have accomplished. It is time for us as nations and as individuals to set aside our long-standing feuds and unite. The tides of an unwinnable war are upon us, and we must seek refuge upon higher ground lest we be swept away by the flood. The Confederacy is no more. Whatever semblance of unity and protection it once provided is a phantom, a memory. With our enemies left unchecked, who will you turn to for protection? The devastation wrought by the alien invaders is self-evident. We have seen our homes and communities destroyed by the calculated blows of the Protoss. We have seen firsthand our friends and loved ones consumed by the nightmare sir. Unprecedented and unimaginable though they may be, these are the signs of our time. The time has come, my fellow Terrans, to rally to a new banner. In unity lies strength. Already many of the dissident factions have joined us. Out of the many, we shall forge an indivisible whole, capitulating only to a single throne. And from that throne, I shall watch over you. From this day forward, let no human make war upon any other human. Let no Terran agency conspire against this new beginning. And let no man consort with alien powers. And to all the enemies of humanity, seek not to bar our way. For we shall win through, no matter the cost. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen, that is the Terran campaign, episode one of StarCraft. I think it really sets up the... I, it's just... I have so many things to say about the first episode, about the... the just, I, it, StarCraft is such a beautifully crafted... It's such a beautiful cra crafted world it's, and story, and the characters, more, more importantly. Did you notice? That's Orktoros Mensk, of course. That's the guy that freed... That's the, the sons of Korhal. The, he was a rebel... Uh, it was a rebel. He freed... Um, he freed um, uh, Sarah Kerrigan. He freed, of course, uh, Raynor. Uh, and I've always felt that they did a disservice to to um, Arcturus Mensk in StarCraft 2. And if you don't know the plot of StarCraft 2, just enjoy StarCraft 1 for right now. Uh, because I feel that Mensk is a very... Well, it's not a very multifaceted character. It doesn't have many facets, but it has two facets, and it's a it's it's got two dimensions to the character, which is more than you, you often get in in games like this. I mean, the the strife and the the trouble that he's caused so far, especially to Rainer, that we're gonna follow in episode two. Uh, well, kind of, uh, and of course to, to Kerrigan, who was killed in uh, in uh, New Gettysburg. Uh, he knows what he's doing. I mean, he's quite clear. He quite clearly wants power. He, he, Arcturus man, make no mistake. He wants to be there. It's, it, it's, it's obvious in what he says. I will lead you, and, and that, that, that cinematic right there is crucial to understanding his character because he, he wants to be a powerful, a uh, powerful person. But if you look at his, uh, at his speech. You can tell that he's got he's got more going on than that. I mean, sure, he's he's against every single other alien race. He's against the Protoss as well, not just the Zerg. Uh, but he's trying his best to save humanity, and he says that all throughout the first game and the second game as well. Truth be told, but he's portrayed in a much more simple manner, and you can't really tell in the second game uh, what what he's going through and all that sort of stuff. Um, so yeah, kind of m mild spoiler right there. Arcturus Mensk is gonna survive the events of the first game and the expansion so but uh, that it's not really a big spoiler don't worry it's all fine um but uh, yeah the second episode is going to bring on a couple very very interesting surprises and a very big turnaround of course if you don't know what is going to happen uh then you haven't uh, followed starcraft at all uh <laughs> because it's quite obvious uh but anyway uh that was i really enjoyed the first episode and i hope you did as well uh, and of course this is episode uh, nine i think of let's play starcraft uh, episode 10 is gonna come around in a few weeks, because in the meantime, we'll be playing the second campaign of Heroes of Might and Magic 3. Uh, of course, if you're not watching this on day of release, you probably can just click over here, uh, and, uh, go for the next video. Uh, but yeah, until then, 
I will be playing this after I complete the second campaign of Heroes of Might and Magic 3. And I am Colonel RPG, and this has been StarCraft. I really hope you've enjoyed it, and if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video. But above all, thank you so much for watching, and I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.